Good morning, Believe Nation. If you are trying to launch a new product or service and you're trying to figure out how do I make this something that my customers are really going to love, then I'm going to share with you a clip from Martha Stewart that I think will help. I have always said ever since I started working that I am my customer. I want to appeal to me. What's missing in my life? What void can I fill that will fill the voids for everybody that's like me? And my mother would always say, nobody's like you, Martha, forget it. And I always said, mother, I am like everybody else. And you know, I have chickens, I have a garden, I scrub the floors, I vacuum my house. I'm just like everybody else. And so she finally got to understand what I was talking about because I always want to please me with what we do. Do I want to buy it? Do I need it? So it's the need and the want. So many entrepreneurs go into business because they think there's this great opportunity ahead of them. And even though they know nothing about the industry they're getting into, they think they can make a lot of money at it. That's the fastest way to failure. And if you are not your own customer, if you're not making something that you are proud of and that you're actually going to use, then how can you expect to sell other people on it? One of the best ways to start a business is to look at the problems in your life, the pains that you're going through, solve them for yourself, and that will help you solve it for other people who are going through the exact same challenge. People will be able to relate to you because you've gone through the same thing that they're going through now. Look at why I started this morning series. It was because I felt there wasn't enough inspiration for entrepreneurs in the morning. I wanted something myself, selfishly, that I could watch every morning for a quick hit, that little espresso shot to give me some energy, ideas, motivation to go out and have a great day as an entrepreneur. There wasn't anything out there and so I was so frustrated that I thought I'm going to just make it myself and the results have been amazing so far. So if you want to design a product or service that you think customers will love, start with designing something that you will love and build around your personal needs and desires because other people have those same problems and if you solve it for yourself, you can help solve it for them. Believe. Thank you guys for watching. My question of the day today is. How have you built your business around something that you love? What problem did you face and how did you turn that into an opportunity for your business? I'd love to hear from you. Leave it in the comments below. And as always, if you like this video and you want to see more, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and the newsletter. Thank you so much for watching. Go out and have an amazing day. And don't forget to tune in tomorrow morning to start your day off with another entrepreneurial, energizing, inspirational video.